Hey, how's it going, everybody? Nature's Greatest Miracle, Rick Santel here. This is the first edition of something that I'm going to try to do bi-weekly, and it's called the Rick Tour Scale. Basically, what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you the ins and outs of the career and life, just what's going on in general in the life of Nature's Greatest Miracle, Rick Santel. That would be me. First thing I'd like to address is my knee injury. I have been receiving a lot of emails at ricksantel at hotmail.com. Uh, I've been receiving messages on my Facebook slash Rick Santel, uh, my MySpace slash Rick Santel, my Twitter, uh, Twitter at Rick Santel. And um, believe it or not, I actually have the footage, I think it's like a 21 second clip of my actual knee injury. Uh, sometime back in April, I was in a match and uh, I did something that I've done probably a million times in the ring. I've been doing this for 11 years and I, I guarantee you I've done this a million times, which is uh, stomp my foot. I stomped my right foot. Uh, there was a board that was slightly raised. Somehow or another, I dislocated my patella. I felt it slip. It slipped to the right. I fell over. I got back up. I continued the match. A few minutes later, I did something. I believe I went to pivot. It slipped again on me. Uh, that time it popped. I got back up again. I felt like I could continue the match. Uh, I believe the match went 12 or 15 minutes, somewhere around in there. Uh, I went to pick up my opponent for the Santel Slam. It slipped again. That time I knew I did not need to get back up. Uh, I rolled out of the ring. Um, I went to the back, uh, went home, and the next morning I got up, went to the emergency room, basically told them what happened. Uh, they checked my knee out. They said it didn't look like something that was going to need surgery, but the unfortunate news was that it would possibly take three to six months to heal. It looks like, unfortunately, I'm on the six-month plan. Uh, that's not where I want to be. I want to be back in the ring. I miss it like crazy. But did I mention that you can go to ricksantel.com? You can watch my knee injury, it's actually on my YouTube. It's my personal YouTube. It's Risky1S. It's my YouTube account. There's some personal things on there. There's some uh, wrestling matches on there. Uh, I think you see me slap around Cassidy Riley on there. You see me uh, slap around Chase Stevens. It's always fun to slap those guys around. Uh, so you can check any of that stuff out. I believe I, I posted it on my Facebook as well. Uh, I have returned to SAW in the form of a commentator. Uh, you'll have to watch the episode on the 18th of September. I believe that's the episode that comes back, and it'll explain to you why and how. Uh, what I'm doing, I'm alongside of Michael Graham commentating. Uh, he acts as if it's painful for him, but I know he loves it. Uh, I can tell. Uh, I mean, he's sitting by Nature's Greatest Miracle and future international heavyweight champion for SAW. So he, he should be honored. He probably is honored. He's just too modest, maybe a little embarrassed to let everyone know. Uh, also, I am able to work out in the gym. So I'm, I'm, I've been able to keep some of my size. Uh, as far as uh, leg exercises go, um, the amount of weight that I can press or push with my legs is drastically been reduced. Uh, I won't give you any numbers, but I am working on it. It is getting better. It's a slow process. Uh, like I said, eventually, hopefully soon, within the next couple of months, I'll be at 100%. Uh, I believe that's all I got for you on this edition. Yeah, that's about it. Uh, I appreciate you guys taking the time out of your day to watch this four-minute clip. Uh, Every two weeks or so, I'm going to try to do this again. If you guys have questions, stuff that you would like for me to address, anything, you can Facebook me. You can MySpace me. You can send me an email, ricksantel at hotmail.com. Like I said, YouTube, 
Risky One F. You can look up my YouTube account. You can watch matches. You can watch things that go on in the day and the life of me. I got some stuff on there with my, my little puppies, you know. Uh, huge Yorkie fan over here. Don't spread that around. I'd hate to have to slap some people around. But, I, again, I appreciate you guys watching this first edition of the Richter Scale. Have a great day, and I'll leave you with this. Oh, my God, it's Rick Santel, and I rock your socks.